Okay, so Tuesday afternoon and I'm just about to pick up the child that I was whinging about earlier. I don't know what he's going to be like when he gets in the car. No doubt he'll be very demanding. He is three after all. He's nearly four. Um, oh, I know it's going to be another evening of annoyance. Um, but that said, having had a day to myself and doing things that I like to do, just catching up on some programs and just enjoying a cup of tea that's warm uh, and in peace is nice. Um, it's kind of put me in a better frame of mind. I had poached egg, I love poached eggs on toast. It's kind of my go-to breakfast because it's so quick and easy and filling as well. Sometimes I cook up some mushrooms, but I'm so lazy. I'm just like, I try and avoid too much washing up. Um, so yeah, that was nice. I had some great twos on that. Um, so that's used my healthy extra B and one of my healthy extra A's. Um, and to be honest, I haven't felt hungry. I've been doing some editing on my computer, fo photo editing, and um, I've kind of just been busy, so not felt hungry, which is good. Collected my s older son from school, um, and because his uh, drama club was starting a bit later tonight, I thought, well, he might as well have some tea. And he'd had a hot dinner at school, so he wanted a cheese and ham sandwich. So I thought, oh, I had a pack of ham, fancy ham, but I've already used my healthy extra B. So I don't know if anyone else has done this, but what I did was I got the slice of ham, put that on my little plate, then got some uh, laughing cow light triangle cheese and put one of those in it and sort of spread it. I have to work at it a bit because straight from the fridge it was a bit tough. But anyway, you spread that on the ham slice and then I put some uh, mixed salad leaf into it um, and then rolled it up. So that's quite nice. And because it's got the laughing cow cheese in there, it kind of sticks it, so that was good. And then had some, uh, two, I did two of those and then um, had four or five cherry tomatoes on the side and then was slicing it. And I think that'll be quite nice for like the, um, uh, what's it called? The little parties that they do in group. Um, Cause I think you, can, um, um, you know, slice them. So they're like little chunks about so big and put a cocktail stick in each. I don't even need to do that. I suppose you could just pick them up with your fingers. Um, so yeah. I was quite pleased with that because that was quite filling um, and no bread used. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm up to at the minute. Uh, I had a hi-fi bar, so there's three sins because of having already used the healthy extra B. Um, not sure what dinner will be tonight. I've got that stuff from Waitrose, you see. I really want to use the chicken, but I'm worried that the sauce on it might be high sins. Hmm. Oh, just that, I was talking about those um, lamb kebabs earlier and I had that with salad. I remembered I also did that with couscous, so it was just normal plain packet couscous, cooked that following the instructions, and then I chopped up some cucumber and some tomatoes and some homegrown, not by me, by the husband, homegrown, um, parsley and chop that up and stirred all that into a bit of lemon juice and had some couscous with it as well that was yum um but yeah so dinner tonight is going to be something simple because i just can't be bothered to cook anything that requires loads of chopping <laughs> of ingredients it's just not gonna happen anyway i've put off long enough going to get the little munchkin I love him really but he just drives me up the wall I know what he's going to ask he'll be it'll be two things it's going to be can I have your phone or the kindle or the brown phone as he calls it which is my old phone so one of those or he's going to request to play a game on tv at home or he'll ask to play the nintendo wii and if he doesn't get the answer that he wants, he's going to have a strop. <laughs> so that's something to look forward to. 
anyway i hope everyone else's week has gone well i'm sort of looking forward to way tomorrow um i'm on the way desk so that's always something to look forward to seeing everyone seeing how everyone's got on and um, but yeah it's a tricky one this week because I, I last time i weighed myself at home when was that probably mon no sunday sunday or monday i can know it's only tuesday whatever anyway i have weighed myself but i didn't weigh myself this morning so i don't know i didn't want to after i didn't want to weigh myself after having wine last night because i just thought probably fucked it up but I'm not having wine tonight so I sort of think oh, what would I like tomorrow I mean I'd like seven pounds please <laughs> that's not gonna happen though because I've not I don't feel like I've been a hundred percent a hundred percent in fact I definitely haven't been a hundred percent because of last night's wine and I had that Chinese on Saturday but I had chicken and oyster sauce. I didn't have boiled rice. I should have opted for boiled rice. But under the pressure of choosing, what do you want, what do you want? I was just like, egg fried rice. Um, but yeah, I didn't have a lot, so. I don't think that would be too much. And then, um, oh, I'm procrastinating now. What would I like off tomorrow? Well, I think I deserve one and a half pounds. But I suspect I will get less than that. The thing is, I only need, what am I now? I weigh ten, nine and a half. And I want it to get to ten, seven. Because what have I lost so far? I lost three, four, I've lost four and a half. Five and a half, six and a half. Yeah, see, what I really want is two and a half pounds, and that'll take me to seven pounds. Oh, Christ, seven pounds. I lost seven pounds in two weeks. In fact, I lost six pounds. The first week I joined, I lost six pounds. Never done that again. Hey ho. What will be, will be. And um, que sera, sera. <laughs> uh, anyway hope everyone else is having a good week and we'll begin again tomorrow